And it's also really exciting to see students have such a passion for Shakespeare and such a passion for acting and theater in general. It's going to the wall, it's going across the lake, it's going through the I just love expressing my feelings in a different manner and I love to dress up and I love to pretend to be somebody I'm not um, and it's just fun to go out there and be somebody else. combining the best of education and Shakespeare and bringing out the best in all kinds of kids who might not necessarily be theater kids, might not necessarily be Shakespeare kids, but um, this kind of work challenges them kinesthetically, intellectually, and even from a social perspective. We have one group who comes to us uh, who are homeschooled kids, so they don't necessarily travel around their life with kids who are uh, a peer group. So today they've got a community. So I think there are lots and lots of strengths that really culminate in a day like today. like a piece of history. You get to go back in time and act totally different than you would today and, or than you would speak today. So it's a whole other experience with everything. I actually didn't really know a lot about Shakespeare until I was able to participate in this last year and I just love Shakespeare's humor and the little quirks he adds in that, it, I don't know, it's just so fun. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I loved the workshops. I loved them. I was so excited about all of them. My students know I was excited about them. They were amazing, all three of them. The one with Cam, with Rebecca, and with Trent. They were so fabulous. And I think the kids really got a lot of exposure to, you know, why acting is so, you know, interesting to study, why it's a craft, and, and you know, the interesting things about Shakespeare that they weren't aware of. So I think it was very eye-opening for them. Three, go!